Hello all, welcome to Binary Programming. In this video, we will solve the second challenge of Advanced Formulas module of Edwin Advanced. The name of the challenge is Use Numbers, Currency and Percentages in Formulas. Let's move to the challenge. So in this challenge, we need to create a number formula that calculates the volume of a cylinder. The formula of volume of cylinder is given to us, it is pi r square h. So what we need to do in this challenge is we need to create two custom fields on the opportunity object called radius and height and then we need to create a formula field called cylinder volume to calculate the formula based on the formula given to us. Apart from this the pi value is also given to us it is 3.14159 and the formula should have zero decimal points. So let's move to the org and complete this challenge. So in this org we are going to the object manager. And in the object manager, we are going to the opportunity object. Here it is. And in the opportunity object, we are going to the fields and relationships. And we are going to click on new. So here the first field which we need to create is radius. So let's copy this thing from here. And the data type of this field should be number. So we are going to select number from this list. And click on save. Here we are going to provide the name which we have copied that is radius and rest of the information we are not going to fill it we are clicking on next next and save. So one field called radius we have created the another field we have need to create is height so let's copy this thing from here and again we are going to follow the same step new Again, the data type should be number. So let's select number from this field. We are going to click on next. We are going to paste the height which we have copied and click on next. Next and save. So two fields we have created. Now we are going to create the cylinder volume formula field. So let's copy the name from here. So here in this list we are going to select the formula and click on next and this is the cylinder volume label which we have copied. So the return type of this formula should be number. So let's select the return type as number and down below there are options like decimal places. We are going to select it as zero as in the challenge they have given us that the formula should have zero decimal points. So we are going to select it as zero. We are going to click on next. And here we are going to write the formula which they have written us. So it is pi r square h. The value of pi is given to us. So let's copy the value from here. And paste it here. Now we are going to insert an operator called multiply. Now we are going to insert the radius field which we have created. So it is in the opportunity. And we need to find out the radius from here. So here is the radius. We are going to insert it. Again we are going to insert an operator called multiply and again we need to insert the radius field. Here it is and again we are going to insert the multiply and this time we are going to insert the height field. Here it is insert. So this is the formula which we have created pi r into r into h. So let's check the syntax of this formula which we have created. We are going to click on check syntax. So yes, there is no error in the syntax. Now we are going to click on next. Next. And finally save. So we have created two fields called radius and height and then we have created a formula field called cylinder home. The return type of this is number and we have put the formula and the rest of the conditions in the challenge which is mentioned in the challenge. So we have completed this challenge. Let's check whether we have done it correct or not. We are going to click on check challenge to one five hundred. So yes, we have completed this challenge. See you guys in the next video with a new challenge. Thank you.